O'Brien's is an oyster bar and restaurant featuring, again, some of the best things that the Bay has to offer. We call it the bounty of the Bay. Uh, we have extensive raw bar selections, fine cuts of dry-aged beef, and again, the freshest seafood, Maryland striped bass, and lobsters that we pick from our tank. Well, O'Brien's is essentially located in the historic district, and by that, I mean we're in the middle of everything. We're right at the bottom of Main Street, uh, just a quick walk away from the State House from Church Circle, our famous city dock, we're a stone's throw from the largest public parking garage downtown. And when you get to our establishment, what we want to impart upon you is something of greatness. You're going to get great food, great service, great ambience, and great nightly entertainment. Well, unbeknownst to many, uh, O'Brien's actually has some history too. Uh, O'Brien's was first opened in 1780 under the uh, name The Rose and Crown, which was again a, a colonial time era bar that actually serviced uh, both loyalists and, uh, shall we say, um, <coughs> colonials as well. Um, O'Brien's has been many incarnations. Uh, for a while, it was a cabaret theater in downtown Annapolis in the early part of the 20th century. It actually served Annapolis's first pizza pie in the 50s. And in the early 70s, it became Fran O'Brien's under the uh, famous or <clears throat> infamous Franny O'Brien, who was a defensive back for the Washington Redskins. Again, we will have families coming in. We constantly will have groups of anywhere between two and 20 midshipmen will come in. They'll sit down, they'll have our burgers, drink our sodas, and leave. Uh, for the sporting events, we have 14 high-definition widescreen televisions, uh, a 106-inch uh, drawdown projection screen. Again, it's the best place to watch sports. It's the best place to have a quick lunch. It's the best place to have a leisurely dinner. And for coming out for dancing, it is Annapolis's largest dance floor.